hello everyone uh, today we are going to learn about uh, latex so latex is a document preparation system in which uh, you do not have to take care about type setting of the document so uh, unlike ms word or any other uh, word processing system uh, which uh, which is quite uh, which we call as viswig that means uh, what you see is what you get uh, you can see the changes or you can see the document and it appears uh, like whatever you type and whatever is the setting you can see it directly so that's why it is called viswig but latex is not like that uh, in in starting you may find it difficult to use uh, but uh, because of its uh, several features and its uh, powerful uh, techniques uh, one can prepare a uh, high quality document in latex so there are uh, different versions uh, of uh, latex and there are different softwares uh, for latex uh, most of them are open source so you can use it freely and uh, LaTeX is also available offline as well as online uh, and today we are going to see and we are going to learn about online version of it so we will see we will see it later uh, that how to go about that but uh, let us understand some uh, advantages of using LaTeX so the first advantage is like uh, suppose you sent a research article in a journal or conference uh, which has a specific format and now suppose uh, your article gets rejected in that journal and you have to send it in another journal uh, what you will have to do you will have to change the whole formatting of that article again which takes uh, a significant amount of time and extra effort uh, in any uh, word processing software like MS Word but it in latex you will see you can do it in less say less than 10 minutes so it's quite easy in latex if you uh, learn it uh, the second advantage is when you write uh, uh, when you or your student writes thesis or or say a book then uh, sometimes you will find that uh, you will you uh, uh, however there are some features which can be used in word processing software also but you will you have to prepare the table of contents list of tables list of figures uh, index uh, at appendices etc uh, but in case of latex uh, you will see that table of contents list of tables uh, all these are automatically created you don't have to create it separately any or you don't have to put any effort in creating these things so this is again one of the most uh, advantage of most important advantage of uh, latex the third significant uh, thing or you can say most one of the most uh, beautiful thing about latex is the references referencing system or bibliography so uh, you you uh, if this this is again a problem that if you are writing a paper then it has certain it follows a certain kind of referencing style and if you are changing that document uh, and you are sending it to another conference or journal then you will have to change the formatting system however there are a few softwares uh, Zotero or other things which can be used in uh, MS Word also but in LaTeX you will see that you don't have to type any uh, reference you just need to copy paste uh, bibtech file from Google Scholar and you can create your own bibliography file which can be used as many as times you want so if you are working on a particular area then you can you will have to prepare the reference bibliography file for the one for one time and you can reuse it anytime and uh, and there are several other benefits which we will see uh, directly on the when we are going when we are going to uh, use that uh, or when we are going to learn about the online version of uh, LaTeX. So let's start learning about LaTeX.